From the Virgil, a production of the ANA Media Group and Consider It Done Productions. Award winning, aging, and awesome. Here are your hosts, Kai Sisson and Aaron Breen. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Aging and Awesome, where we strive to inform, enlighten, and inspire older people to stay active, healthy, and young at heart. Welcome, Breen. Sounds like we have some uplifting stories on tap tonight. We do, boss. <laughs> now we're gonna show you how the Nevada Donor Network saving lives and how you may be able to take part. A few weeks ago, we told you about the Better Business Bureau and they're holding a seminar with the Federal Trade Commission here in Reno. Well, tonight, we're gonna show you how all that went. And of course, we've got that ride in Kai's cab. But first, speaking of uplifting, a story about planning ahead for your own mobility. Summit Elevator can help you better manage your quality of life. For some, a lift can be an immediate medical necessity, and for others, it's actually just planning for the future. Not only is this house amazing, it is seriously geared as a forever home. You see, they're building every inch of it with the future in mind. Just look at this view. It's something I don't believe I'll ever get tired of. It is spectacular. And just to see that the mountain range, the Sierras, is just Reno Sparks. It's beautiful. I love it. It's got automated everything. Hey, Josh, closed dining room shades. We got in floor heating throughout, so that's why it's nice and comfortable. It's the, the heating's always up, so it's wonderful. And it has an elevator. You have an elevator. I know, it's amazing. Actually, you know what, it's been a dream of mine because when we designed this house, it's our retirement home. So every room in the house is designed with three foot doors. Specifically, the elevators have three foot doors as well in case you have to get a wheelchair. We'll have full access down to the basement as well. Now that's planning ahead. Nick Cook with Summit Elevator says what used to be cost prohibitive is becoming more and more commonplace. For Summit Elevator, we do um, just strictly private residence. When I first got into elevators about 10 years ago, it was definitely an older demographic there to where now it's, we, we are, we're seeing people even in their late 30s installing elevators with the, um, with the idea of just future planning. It was very cost effective, actually. So Summit Elevator did just an amazing job. And even then, from the beginning, from the design, they were always involved to make sure and ask the right questions. They hit it on the head. It was perfect. So everything fit, slid right into place. It was great. So Summit did an amazing job. We've always seen this as a really high luxury item. You know, if you ever had a friend or say some, you know, somebody and they're like, oh, we have an elevator in our house. And it was always like, whoa, you guys must be millionaires. <laughs> It's not the case anymore. It's a very affordable option to either plan into the design of a new house or what we're seeing as well is adding them to existing houses. Some need an elevator or a stair lift because of a medical emergency like a knee or a hip replacement. Some just want to be prepared. I would say about 50 to 60% of our clients, it's something that's being used right now. And then probably the other 40% is, I don't necessarily need it right now, but this is an option that I can certainly see value and being able to help us age in place. And elevators and lifts are something more and more veterans need and are having installed. So we work with the VA, Veterans Administration, and it's an awesome relationship that we have with them. We do a decent amount of lifts. I'd say we're probably doing about 100 lifts a year for veterans. Which is a perk for Summit Elevator, and for the veterans. They are incredibly humble, humble individuals, and they're just, they're incredibly thankful. I mean, they, they are just so happy to have you there and being able to provide something that can give them a sense of normalcy. 
It, it warms the soul for sure. Uh, you know, I mean, it's one of the biggest things that we hear from them is they put that lift in and you get a phone call, you know, a week or two later. Nick, thank you. We, we appreciate you coming out here. Why didn't I do this five or 10 years ago? Summit Elevator also deals in chairlifts and stairlifts. And the good news is if lifts and elevators sound like a good idea for you, you can find out the options that you have for free. Summit Elevator does free consultations to see what would be involved at your own house. And you can find all of their contact information on our website, agingandawesome.com. Thanks, Breen. Now don't go away. So much more to come, including why the Federal Trade Commission was here in Reno for a recent seminar and how that highlights businesses here. And do you know what the Nevada Donor Network does, how it works, and how you get involved? More on that soon. Plus, the ride in my cab. But first, we reconvene with Aaron Breen right after this. Don't go away. I thought there was nothing people could do about scams until I found Better Business Bureau's Scam Tracker website. There, I learned about scams in my area. I, I lost, lost a lot, lot of, of money. money. And I shared my story, too. I was offered an online work-from-home job. I spent all this money on course training materials, but there was no job. So be careful. Thanks, Thanks for, sharing for sharing that. that. You're welcome. Better Business Bureau. Start with trust. Eden Home Health is Northern Nevada's highest rated home health for quality of patient care. You have a choice. Ask your doctor for the best in home health care, Eden Home Health. And Eden Hospice. The personalized care team at Eden Hospice is dedicated to focusing on your loved one's quality of life during a difficult time. Eden Hospice's mission is to ensure dignity for every patient. Find out how Eden Hospice can help your family by calling 841-6123. You've planned ahead your whole life for your job, your home, your children, and for your retirement. But have you taken the time to prepare an estate plan? Most people haven't. We are the Trust Masters. Over the years, we have helped hundreds of families and business owners prepare an affordable estate plan. Go to our website at trustmasters.com to set up a free consultation and sign up for one of our educational workshops or just give us a call. We are the Trust Masters. Living trust, don't leave earth without one. You know, sometimes you just have to give up on things. It seems like if you stick to it long enough, you should be able to achieve anything. But over time, I gotta say, I have learned that there are times in life when you really need to just cut your losses. I mean, if it's all stacked against you sometimes, you gotta give in or maybe even find an acceptable compromise. Case in point, my dishes. <laughs> That's right, plates, glassware, silverware. I gave up on all of it matching long ago, <laughs> I'm sure. When I got married, like most people, I had a few matching place settings, maybe three. I mean, my mother, in her day, she had two full sets of matching china. Everything matched, and so did all the glassware. But you know what? We never used those good dishes. You know what? It never got broken. Why? Because it lived in a china cabinet. I don't even have a china cabinet. <laughs> but I do have kids. And once I had kids, I saw that enough dishes was more important than having them match. And while no one ever means to break them, it happens so often. So I started just collecting anything with blue in it. And I did it all at the thrift stores. I got glasses, dishes, picked up plates when I'd see them. Anytime I saw something I really liked, I'd just pick it up and kind of mix it into this crazy, crazy array that I have in the cabinet. And in my cabinet, it does look crazy. Most of these were all purchased four at a time. Now I'm lucky if even two match, because you know what, they get broken, but they also all go together. <laughs> Wine glasses, now there's another one. I used to think it was pretty cool when they all matched but then drinks got all mixed up. That's crazy. And one year, my mother-in-law, God rest her soul, love her, but she broke four wine glasses in one day on Thanksgiving. She didn't mean to do it, she just kept dropping them. And that's when I gave up, it was that day, on buying them and I just started buying them a couple at a time when I saw some that I liked. Didn't matter if they matched. And once I did that, just gave up on the whole thing, I no longer really care when one gets broken. Sure. I'd like them all to match, but in a way, this is a lot more fun and way less stressful. For Aging and Awesome, I'm Aaron Breen. Reconvene with Aaron Breen is presented by the Medicare Store. 
The Medicare Store offers free, unbiased, personal Medicare advice. Visit themedicarestore.com to find a location near you. If you or a loved one is having mobility issues involving stairs in their home, Summit Elevator can help. Summit Elevator can install an attractive and effective elevator that will give you the convenience you need to help your loved one safely reach an upper or lower level of your home. Our professional staff will carefully discuss the options and costs that fit your specific needs. Summit Elevator installs quality mobility products and is a locally family-owned company that has been serving Northern Nevada for over 20 years. Call Summit Elevator today. I'm already on Medicare. Can I ignore all this mail? I keep hearing I can get more from my Medicare. How do I do that? Reply Hazy. Ask again. This eight ball is just as confused as everyone else. You're not using that right. Give me that. Where can I get Medicare advice? The Medicare store. Have you tried calling your neighbors at the Medicare store? Visit the Medicare store on South Meadows Parkway and US 395 in South Reno. Aging and Awesome is presented by Seniors in Service and the Foster Grandparent Program, helping at-risk children meet academic standards while providing positive intergenerational social interaction. The Foster Grandparent Program is looking for new volunteers. With a minimum commitment of only five hours a week, the Foster Grandparent Program is an excellent opportunity to give back to kids in our community. To apply to be a foster grandparent, Give them a call at 775-358-2768 or visit SeniorsInServiceNevada.org. Life is story. Pages of amazing adventure and narrow escapes. Bold steps taken, races run, chapters on love and heart lessons and new beginnings. Your life, your legacy, our privilege to serve. Morningstar Senior Living. Welcome back. Next week is April already, and that is National Donate Life Month. We're met with the Nevada Donor Network to share how they're getting the word out about this really important cause that really does save lives. We're joining you from the Senior Care Plus offices over on Del Monte Way, and we're here to talk about transplants and organ donors because we all may be needing to become a part of this whole network, you know? This is Monica Miles from the Nevada Donor Network. Thank Correct. you for joining Thank us. Thank you. I read that there were 104,000 people across the country waiting for organs right now, That's and cool. more than 600 right here in Nevada. So seems like we could all be a part of the solution to this, right? Yes, that's correct. It's really a national emergency. Unfortunately, every nine minutes, someone else will be added to that transplant waiting list, and 17 people die every day waiting. And so what we can all do is make the choice to become a registered donor. And it's so easy, it just takes a minute or two, but I think some people get scared, they don't fully understand how organ and tissue donation works, and so, they, well, you um, are here to and so them. here I am. Yeah. <laughs> here I am. So um, if you have gone to the DMV and you have already registered, you might have that cute little red heart on your license, which we mm -hmm. love. That's how you'll know that you are a registered donor through the DMV. But a lot of people don't know you don't have to make a special trip to the DMV just to register because let's be honest, we may not just want to make a special trip for that, even though we love the DMV. <laughs> but you can register anytime on our website, which is mvdonor.org, or even in your iPhone, which a lot of people don't know, in the health app, you can go up into the corner into the profile, scroll down a little bit, and you'll see a little section that says organ donation, and you can register right there. Wow. So, yes, lots of easy ways to register. You know, I think one of the myths that we should talk about with your audience is a lot of people think they're too old or too sick, and nobody would want anything that they would have to donate. Oh, people want it. They want it. And again, I, I think we need to think about those people that are desperately waiting um, and may only have a few hours to live. Um, and someone who 
could be this generous at the end of their life. It can prolong the lives of others, enhance the lives, give people the gift of sight. It's really profound, the impact that one donor can have. And because so, there's so many things that they can use, Absolutely. Right? I think we all know about organ donation. It's a miracle. It saves lives. But what we don't usually hear a lot about is tissue donation, cornea donation, which again will give sight, skin graft donation, which will help people with severe burns. One tissue donor can potentially save 75 or more people, give them healing, um, allow them to get back to a normal life. And so what I would tell your audience that might be worried they can't be a registered donor is the oldest organ donor was 95 years old and he saved the life of someone else with his liver. When you go to the DMV or when you register on your iPhone, no one asks you for a medical history. No one cares because the reality is anyone can register if, that's, if, if it feels important to you, if it feels like something that's right to you. And then every donor is evaluated on a case-by-case -case basis right. at so the time they, of death. Well, you may think you don't have a lot to offer, but they're going to look at it and say, well, we could use your liver. Maybe Absolutely. Not, you know. yeah. Absolutely. And so every donor is evaluated case-by-case -case basis by medical professionals. Mm -hmm. And so we just ask that people not count themselves out and just make that choice to register. Okay. And one more time, where do they go? So they can go to nvdonor.org or go ahead and visit the DMV. We love our partners there. Thank you so very much. Monica Miles, thank you so much for coming. Thank in. you for having me. Closed captioning for Aging and Awesome is brought to you by... At Reno Eye Institute, you'll get the attention you deserve from a doctor who cares. Well, my eyesight was declining fairly rapidly, so I was recommended to see Dr. Freeman. The surgery was an excellent success, and he was great to work with. I enjoyed it, and he was very professional at all times. I would strongly recommend Dr. Freeman and his staff. At Reno Eye Institute, our focus is you. Now accepting new patients. Call Reno Eye Institute today at 451-7268. Welcome back to Aging and Awesome. What could be important enough to bring the Federal Trade Commission to Reno? Well, concerns about consumer protection, of course. Here's a look at the Better Business Bureau's recent seminar addressing them. The Better Business Bureau was instrumental in bringing the Federal Trade Commission here a few weeks ago to bring us all up to date on protecting ourselves from costly scams. We also share with law enforcement, so the Federal Trade Commission talked about Consumer Sentinel earlier, and so that data goes, I believe, almost on a daily basis now to the Federal Trade Commission. Some trends continue. Younger adults are more likely to fall for like an online shopping scam. While young people might be scammed more often, when it's elderly people, it's more money taken. And some scams you hear about elsewhere are here in Nevada as well. Okay, what was the big difference between 2021 and 2022 for things that are reported? Well, there were, I think, two notable trends. Um, we saw a real uptick in investments, people reporting losses to investment scams, like cryptocurrency scams. The losses almost doubled from 2021. And then also business imposter scams, which are an entity is impersonating a legitimate business. Those scams just really skyrocketed and they continue to. You know, when you get emails from websites that sure look like they are legitimate, don't trust them. Something that I will say is specific to Nevada is we're seeing a lot of solar scams because there are a lot of solar companies in Nevada because it's a very sunny place. So there are legitimate solar companies here, but then of course, wherever there's a, an, an industry, there are going to be the bad actors that come in and um, try to scam people. So if you are approached by one, take your time. Don't let anyone rush you. I would say when it's door-to-door -door sales, a lot of the time the scammers, but even some legitimate door-to-door -door sales people, unfortunately use high pressure sales tactics. Sign right away, do this, sign on the dotted line, let's do it today, let's get this deal closed. And scammers will do the same thing, right? Because they don't want you to go ahead and research if they're legitimate or not. 
So I would say hesitate, stop, really think about the contract, really think about what you're signing on to. Don't feel pressured to sign it that same day. Maybe say ask for a copy and review it with a friend or you know friends or family. You're in control, you're the customer, you're the one who would potentially be paying the money, so don't feel like uh, they are, they can control the situation. And whether online, on the phone, in the mail, or at your door, one rule always applies. Be very cautious on who you're giving money to uh, or who you're giving your personal information to. Make sure you know who they are. Double check. Rick Dutton is a consumer affairs investigator. He sees all kinds of scams in Nevada and has his own set of rules to follow. Best advice is prior to a sale, do, do your research. See if the business has a return policy, a refund policy. Pay by credit card if you can because there's additional protections. And if a person promises you something prior to a sale, get it in writing. It's true that scams seem to morph, making keeping up with them tough. It's always a cat and mouse game. Um, they're, they're, as soon as we're onto one and kind of the, that one dies because a lot of people are aware of it and can spot the red flags, they'll come up with a new twist. But there was some good news at the seminar. While complaints here in Nevada are up, the total amount of complaints last year was over 3,000 complaints. And that was uh, up about 500 complaints from the year previous. The work by investigators like Rick, who hold businesses accountable, is paying off. And last year, we were able to uh, get back for consumers in restitution, 1.7 million. So if you fall victim to a scammer, don't be embarrassed, be proactive, and report it. For more info on the Better Business Bureau's Scam Tracker, how to report and how to track scams in our area, head to our website, agingandawesome.com, and click on the Featured Segments tab. If you're 64 or 65 and newly eligible for Medicare, you only have a few months to enroll, or you may incur a late enrollment penalty. By understanding Medicare now, you'll have time to get a full picture of the choices that are right for you. Join experts from Senior Care Plus for a free ABCs of Medicare seminar to learn about Medicare and the options available to you. Sign up at SeniorCarePlus.com or call 775-982-3158 today. Thinking about moving or downsizing? You should meet my good friend, Marsha Rambo, with Realty One Group Eminence, with over 35 years experience and specializing in helping older people. If you're looking for a home that better fits your lifestyle, Marsha is the right person for you. Thanks, Joe. I'm Marsha Rambo, and I'm a realtor. I'll help you find the right home at any stage of your life. Whether you're considering selling your home or making a purchase, give me a call at 775-395-9133. Together, we'll make a plan that will best work for you. Call Marsha today and tell her I sent you. <laughs> Hi, I'm David Wise, three-time Olympic medalist and proud Nevadan. I'm a registered donor. Did you know that more than 100,000 people in America are waiting on a life-saving transplant? I support Nevada Donor Network's efforts to raise awareness on organ, eye, and tissue donation. One heroic donor can save and heal up to 75 lives. Everyone has the power to be someone's hero. Join us at wearenevadans.org. Hello, hello, hello. Thank you so much for sticking around here on Aging and Awesome. You know, folks, we are in our fifth year of doing this. It's been a long time, it feels, but it's been so fun, so rewarding. And the reason we're able to keep it going is because of people that uh, are in the community, own businesses, see how we reach seniors in a positive, informative way, and then they want to be a part of that. And that's Krista Meyer with Krista Meyer Law and Life Care Planning of Reno. She's in the back seat right now. Hello. Welcome, Krista. Thank you for having me. You've been in town a long, long time. I have. As an attorney, helped a lot of people with guardianship and... Estate planning and Medicaid planning is our real specialty. Not a lot of attorneys work in that area. Helping families with long-term care, applying for Medicaid, whatever we need to do to help families as they're aging. That is so, so important. And uh, working in the healthcare field, I know that's the one of the biggest hurdles. People don't know where to go for things like that. So. 
Krista Meyer, thank you so much for coming on the show. You coming bet. in the cab, that's the fun part. I didn't know about that part. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. You came to our taping and uh, I said, don't you go nowhere. Here we are. You know the rules? Yes. What are they? You give me questions, I get to choose A through C, I think. <laughs> and you give me hints when I don't know. <laughs> I don't know about that, but get three out of four questions right today and uh, we'll give you some chocolate. <laughs> Perfect. All right, here we go. Question number one for Krista. What is the only fruit with seeds on the outside? A, coconut, B, banana, C, star fruit, or D, strawberry? Star fruit. Star fruit, is that your final answer? Yes. Yeah. Oh, strawberry. <laughs> don't put that one up. It's got the little thing. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I Those don't know what seeds. the star fruit is, so I guess star fruit. <laughs> oh, my goodness gracious. That's okay. You're allowed to get one wrong. Okay. So you got to get the next three right. Here we go. <laughs> Question number two for Krista. What is the name of the group of men who elects a pope? A, collection of priests. B, college of cardinals. C, anointed fathers. Or D, the good old boys. I would say anointed fathers. Anointed fathers, Krista. Is that your final answer? Yes. <laughs> the college of cardinals. How would I know that? I didn't realize that I'd stump you two in a row there. Um, I'm so sorry, Krista, you're not a winner today. Yeah! <laughs> but you know, you were so fun and uh, we really do appreciate you being a community stakeholder of the show. Uh, and I love to ask everybody in the cab. So even though you only got the opportunity to answer two questions, yes. we'd love to hear your, your uh, wisdom on life. 15 seconds, go ahead. Well, I'm here with my dad today. So just keep trying new things, I think. Just started pickleball. We used oh. to play soccer and indoor soccer. And you know, as we age, we change it up a little bit. So just keep changing things and being there for people and being part of the community. Oh, that was awesome. Yes, and her dad is up next. Uh, and he will actually get the questions right. <laughs> next week on Aging and Awesome, we got Krista's dad. Uh, thank you so much again, and uh, we'll, we'll, do, we'll have a rematch. So. All right, perfect. You have to give me sports. <laughs> okay, deal. Kai's Cab is presented by Senior Care Plus, the only Nevada-based, not-for-profit Medicare Advantage plan serving Washoe County and Carson City. Senior Care Plus, for the healthiest reasons. Well, we're about out of time. Thanks so much for joining us here at the Virgil. Thank you to the Virgil for having us and our own music man, Colin Ross, for coming on by. Thanks to all of you at home. And thanks to all of our community stakeholders who make this show possible. Thank you to... The Trustmasters. The Medicare Store. The Better Business Bureau. Eden Home Health and Eden Hospice. Morningstar Senior Living of Sparks. Seniors in Service. Krista Meyer Law. Life Care Planning Reno, LLC. Marsha Rambo with Realty One Group Eminence. Reno Eye Institute, Summit Elevator. And Senior Care Plus. And we'll see you right back here next time. Thank you again. Good night, everybody. Business Bureau investigates and reports on scams that hurt consumers through the BBB Scam Tracker website. Here, some people share their stories and others educate themselves. And together, we empower our community.